I'm trapped up in the sky, yeah You can't bring me down You can't bring me down No, you can't bring me down I turn up, turn up, turn up, turn up You can't turn me down No, you won't leave me down No, you won't see me down I'm high up in the sky What's up, Royal Family? It's your girl, Mashki, and I'm back with another video Um, so I hope my head not cut off I know it's cropped, but Every time I put it on the last time, I was like different, so sorry about that. All right, so as you can see by the title of this video, I'm going to be doing a review over this tripod that I bought for Amazon. I'm gonna have to make this video fast because I don't need to cut this camera only has two bars. So let's open the up. You know what? This didn't take more. All right, where is it? Thought about it. I just cleaned out the trash in my studio. Ah, okay, so hmm, this is called the Cubo Cubo Bone Tripod. Thumbnail. After this, I'm gonna play with this um, camera and just see because what it is that I try to put the camera on the ring light because the ring light got its own stand for the camera and phone and everything. And as you can see, it looks good. Y'all know what? Y'all know I struggle with this. Don't worry about it. It's gonna work out all for the best, okay? Okay, all right, let's go. doing too much huh? all right so this is what comes in here you have a tripod right here you have this is for your GoPro if you have a GoPro uh, yeah okay that's it and then this is your phone mount so I like these better because of the fact that you can put it like this and it holds the phone this way, you put it like this, it holds the phone, oh my bad. You put it like this, it holds the phone um, landscape mode this way, and then you put it like this, and it's, it'll hold it in portrait mode, so. I like that, I'm glad I got that. This was about, I think it was $25 after taxes, 26. I'll put it down there in the description box below, so you go buy it. It's not been a bend, it's not been a break, and y'all that scared me. I did not expect that. All right, so let's see what this thing can do. All right, so here we got your mount where you mount your camera, your phone stand on. Uh, oh, okay. Mm, let's see what happens. Oh, oh okay. All right, y'all see that? This is an adjustable head. Okay, cool beans, cool beans. All right, so, got it here, take it down here, and it'll go all the way to the side. So you could connect your mount right here. Ooh, y'all, I'm so glad I bought this. Oh my gosh, this is well needed, thank you. I'm saying thank you like this is a review video. I don't a review video, I don't Okay, so, take this out, bam, bam. Okay, that's good. That's cool. That's cool. All right. Let me pull it back. Once you, my head is so off. So, click on these. Put it here, and bam. And that's it. That's 
small. Let's see if this comes off. It might, let's see, this should come off. Okay, so if you don't want the adjustable head, as you can see, all you gotta do is twist it off. It'll come off and you'll be able to put your phone or your mount on here. And what you do is you wanna make sure that this is visible because what you're gonna, cause, okay, let me show you. Cause you have to give it enough room for it to screw down on here. I know y'all probably, I'm so, so sorry. So, okay, there we go. All right. Hey. All right, so that's better. I pushed the camera back. I just pushed the camera back, okay? All right. So, let's take. Hmm. The battery doing pretty good. Off the camera. Oh, well, I guess maybe I'll just slow down until it starts beeping red. All right, so. Take this out. You have you in right here. And you have the piece right here. So you have it for your portrait mode and your landscape mode. Horizontal horizon. <laughs> Wait, horizontal vertical. Yeah, okay. Hor horizontal is the horizon and vertical is, I don't know how, what they did to remember that. So, all right. Like I said, just screw it. Make sure you see it. And then you put it in its place. Now, what I do sometimes, I just I just usually twist it sometimes instead of just doing, you know, turning the knobs. But like I said, you can twist it. And you can also you'll end up twisting this part. Hmm. It lets you know. Let's see. So uh I gotta see how you'll do it. No, you probably just have to twist it on here. Okay, so here you go. Drop out. Bam. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Mm. E Looking good, huh? Looking real good. All right, so I like this. I really do. Another good investment into my YouTube channel. Bang, bada bing, bada boom. I showed you what was what, showed you how to use it. Um, it comes with an instruction manual. Let's see. Thank you for purchasing your Quill Quillis Bana products. Through that uh, ball head tripod. Okay, that's called, this is called, it's called a ball head. We're going to get it right. It's called a ball head, okay? Well, what do I call it? I call it adjustable. Adjustable. And you got, this is your tripod. So. Um, hmm. Let's see. Okay, okay. I showed you all of that. So, cool. All right. Well, I showed you how to really use it. It's just the instruction manual you telling you extra stuff. So, don't worry about that. All right. So, thanks for watching this video. I know my hair was kind of cut off, still kind of cut off. But once I figured out I just had two notches, I had to do what I had to do. Sometimes you got to do what you got to do to get your videos out there. As long as it look, if it didn't look good, I wouldn't post it. But, you know, a little head chop off, it is what it is. It happens to the best of us, okay? Okay. All right, so, thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope I did a good review of this tripod. Um, From the feel of it and from the looks of it, yes, I recommend that you buy it if you don't mind spending $26 on this on Amazon. Like I said, the link will be down in the description box below. That being said, be sure to like, share, comment, subscribe, follow me on all my social media, and that's it. I'm out. Peace.